The James Webb Space Telescope, a NASA and ESA joint project, is the world's most powerful space telescope. It has been designed to explore the furthest reaches of the observable universe and has recently made a remarkable discovery. In a single observation, the telescope detected over 700 galaxies at our universe's edge. These galaxies are believed to be among the oldest and most distant galaxies ever observed providing new insights into the formation and evolution of galaxies. This discovery could help scientists understand the universe's evolution and how galaxies form and evolve. The James Webb Telescope unveiled hundreds of ancient galaxies. Exciting news regarding the James Webb Telescope's recent discoveries has just been announced. According to the telescope's data, hundreds of ancient galaxies have been located potentially marking them as some of the earliest galaxies to have formed in the universe. This revelation is a significant step forward from the limited handful of ancient galaxies that were previously known, and it opens up a world of possibilities for further exploration and discovery. It's truly remarkable to consider what other groundbreaking findings may be uncovered with the aid of this remarkable technology. Astonishingly, a new study has found that galaxies formed complex structures and star clusters just 600 million years after the Big Bang. This revelation was made through the JWST Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey, or JADES, which gathered a month's worth of observations from two small sections of the sky, one in the Ursa Minor constellation and the other in the direction of the Fornax cluster. The region contained over 700 newly discovered young galaxies, providing a glimpse into the universe's appearance in its earliest days. Truly fascinating. If you took the whole universe and shrunk it down to a two-hour movie, you are seeing the first five minutes of the movie. Kevin Hainline, an assistant research professor at the Stewart Observatory in Arizona and lead author of the new study, said while announcing the discovery on Monday, June 5th at the 242nd meeting of the American Astronomical Society being held in Albuquerque and online. These are the galaxies that are starting the process of making the elements and the complexity that we see in the world around us today. The recently uncovered information provides valuable knowledge regarding the beginnings of the earliest galaxies and stars, which eventually gave rise to the multitude of elements we can observe throughout the universe in modern times. In only five minutes, a team of researchers led by Hainline observed the universe using Webb's telescope. During their observation, the team made an incredible discovery. They identified an astounding 717 galaxies that existed when the universe was between 370 million and 650 million years old. These galaxies were already quite sizable and complex, stretching across thousands of light years and producing countless star clusters. The sheer activity and dynamism of these celestial phenomena are truly awe-inspiring and serve as a testament to the vastness and beauty of the universe. Previously, the earliest galaxies we could see just looked like little smudges. And yet those smudges represent millions or even billions of stars at the beginning of the universe, Hainline said. Now we can see that some are actually extended objects with visible structure. The depth of the universe's mysteries is unfathomable yet we continue to uncover new wonders through our most excellent telescope's relentless cosmos exploration. The Good South region, studied extensively by Hubble, the Chandra X-ray Observatory, and Spitzer, still holds secrets to be discovered. Thanks to the groundbreaking work of Webb during JADES, we have glimpsed 93% of galaxies never seen before, reminding us of the endless possibilities for discovery that lie ahead. Recent Reflection on the Theory of the Big Bang One of the universe's biggest mysteries is how the chaotic and dusty environment transformed into a crystal-clear cosmos we see today. The Epoch of Reionization, a crucial phase in the universe's evolution, has long been debated as the answer to this question. It's believed that this phase occurred around 400,000 years after the Big Bang, when the first generation of stars existed. These stars were massive, 30 to 300 times our sun's mass and shone millions of times brighter. They flooded the opaque universe with their light, marking the beginning of a new era. Did you know that the universe was recognized by ultraviolet starlight? Crazy, right? 
It split hydrogen atoms into protons and electrons, which lasted until one billion years after the Big Bang. But get this. There's a new theory that believes that supermassive black holes could have played a more significant role in cosmic evolution than previously thought. In this next scene of the universe, we are starting to actually see the impact of galaxy formation on the composition of the large-scale universe, Ryan Ensley, a postdoctoral researcher at the University of Texas who led the second study, said at a news conference on Monday, Galaxies in the very early universe were just far more chaotic in general in how they form stars. The impressive work of Ensley's team has shed light on the fascinating star formation process in the early galaxies. Their findings revealed that a remarkable one in six of these galaxies exhibited extreme line emissions in their spectra, a remarkable feature that arises when atoms, ionized by the starlight, combine with other molecules after cooling down. It is truly remarkable to see how much can be learned from studying the signs of star formation in these ancient galaxies. Early galaxies were powerful creators, birthing stars that radiated ultraviolet photons into the universe. These stars became the primary force behind the cosmic reionization process, illuminating the vast expanse of space and shaping our understanding of the universe's origins. According to Ensley's team, Galaxies in the early universe had a unique way of birthing stars. They would go through short bursts of star formation, followed by periods of calm. During these bursts, we're talking about tens of suns worth of solar masses being assembled simultaneously. This is significant because the hot, massive stars produce many ultraviolet photons, essential for ionizing all the hydrogen in the early universe. Ensley emphasized the importance of this discovery during a news briefing, and it's clear to see why. The James Webb Space Telescope has found the oldest known organic molecules in the universe located 12 billion light years away from Earth. It has made an extraordinary discovery in astronomy. A cloud of complex organic molecules located in a galaxy 12.3 billion light years away from Earth. This breakthrough finding, published in the prestigious journal Nature, has the potential to unlock even more knowledge about the development of galaxies. The possibilities for exploration and discovery are endless, and this remarkable feat of technology is leading the way for future scientific breakthroughs. We didn't expect this, Joaquin Vieira, an astronomer at the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign and co-author of the new study, said in a press release, detecting these complex organic molecules at such a vast distance is game-changing. The molecules in question are called polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, or PAHs. PAHs are frequently found in wildfire smoke and car exhaust on Earth. In space, they could be significant in star formation. Scientists believe they may regulate the temperature of gas clouds in areas where stars develop, known as stellar nurseries. The JWST can detect PAHs by looking into the correct infrared range. Recently, the team focused the telescope on the galaxy and discovered a cluster of complex organic molecules in August. Interestingly, the team noticed areas in the galaxy without PAH clouds where stars were forming. This phenomenon still needs to be fully understood, and further research is needed to explore how organic molecules interact with these star-forming regions. The James Webb Space Telescope allows scientists to study the universe in greater depth, the James Webb Space Telescope's ability to detect these distant galaxies is a testament to its technological prowess. Its large mirror, sensitive instruments, and advanced detectors have allowed astronomers to peer deeper into space than ever before. This achievement marks a significant milestone in our quest to unravel the universe's mysteries and better understand our place within it. Detecting those galaxies at the farthest reaches of our universe has sparked an intriguing new perspective for astronomers. It grants them a remarkable opportunity to delve into the beginnings of galaxy formation and development. By examining the light emitted by those remote galaxies, scientists can gain insight into the mechanisms that gave rise to the structures in our universe, including stars, galaxies, and even larger structures such as galaxy clusters. In conclusion, the James Webb Space Telescope's discovery of 700 galaxies at the edge of our universe is groundbreaking. This finding provides valuable insights into the early stages of galaxy formation 
and the processes that shape our universe. Astronomers can deepen our understanding of cosmic reionization and the evolution of structures in our universe. The James Webb Telescope's technological advancements have allowed us to explore deeper into space and uncover new, previously inaccessible wonders. This discovery sets the stage for future discoveries and expands our knowledge of the vast cosmos. Make sure to let us know your thoughts down below, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more updates on NASA. Thanks for watching.